Sky-high gas prices have rideshare drivers demanding help from Lyft and Uber, or they say they'll strike on St. Patrick's Day next week. Mario Ramirez has more. It's crazy, uh, super expensive. We can really, you know, make enough money to pay the bills. Thousands of drivers like Jorge have already signed a petition on coworker.org. Almost 7,000 signing, calling on Uber and Lyft to do more, take a smaller commission from fares, or raise the rates to offset the skyrocketing gas prices. They too damn high. Gas prices is too high. I'm out here trying to Uber and get my money, and every time I turn around, I'm paying more for gas. Drivers are now contemplating whether or not the payoff is worth it. We put everything on the car gas maintenance and the high price on gas is affecting a lot. The price is still increased. I will be trying to find another kind of job. Uber released a statement reading in part, our platform only works if it works for drivers. So we'll continue to monitor gas prices and listen to drivers over the coming weeks. So the customer paid 1365 airport $4 fee. So Uber got 503 out of 1365, I got 452. Our take has dropped and we're paying outrageous gas prices and they're not compensating us at all for that. So it's work a lot more to make a lot less. We don't cover our, our expenses, that's it. So you're thinking about stopping and just days yeah a couple of days and if it goes up i stop i can't walk anymore according to data from AAA, california's average price for a gallon of unleaded was 376 one year ago today it's 557 that's almost a price difference of two dollars in the last year some drivers say they're planning on organizing a strike for sometime next week reporting from lax i'm mario ramirez fox 11 news